For royal families in Middle Age, it was not uncommon for cousins to marry cousins because they wished that power stays in family. Although it had very ugly consequences because of small genetical diversity. Also, if ruler was weak or there was many would be rulers after death of ruler, then armed conflicts or even civil wars were not uncommon. That is why treason was so serious crime and could be punished by death and that is why many rulers were afraid of their position and that they will be overthrown and got paranoid. This sets stage for Mary Stuart versus Elizabeth the first. Many wished to see Mary Stuart as Elizabeth the first successor. And that took Mary in Elizabeth's bedside. All went more or less good until Mary Stuart's second husband died in suspicious death. Although he was drinker and it is even ironic that Elizabeth warned Mary not to marry him. Afterwards, Mary ran away towards Elizabeth because she thought Elizabeth as her friend. They were cousins. But Elizabeth did not see it that way and helped to imprison Mary. After almost two decades, 19 years of imprisonment, Elizabeth intercepted Mary's letter where she wished to overthrow Elizabeth out of desperation and treason was something which Elizabeth could not let to slide and was forced to execute M Mary. Although it is ironic that after Elizabeth's death her throne was succeeded by Mary Stuart's son, James.